All right, what's up, Jump Rope Nation? This is your man, Jumping Rope, Levi James. Today, we're talking about other famous boxes that we obviously want to emulate with our jump rope training. There's no way I'm ever going to be as big or as powerful as Iron Mike Tyson, but let me tell you, I can definitely emulate his jump rope skills, which are quite incredible. We were talking before about Floyd Mayweather and his flow, side to side, his crossover game. Now we're gonna talk about Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson is built on speed and absolute power. If you've seen him jump rope, you know how explosive he is. But when he's jumping rope, he's actually executing only three or four complicated moves in succession very powerfully. The side swipes, the jump squats, the crossovers, and the double unders. So today, we're gonna to explore how to jump rope like Mike Tyson. Here we go. So the important thing to understand is the basic bounce to side swipe, getting in and out of the loop. Basic bounce, side swipe. Basic bounce, side swipe. If you haven't already mastered these two very basic elements, please click on the link here, 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 or here. <laughs> if you haven't already mastered these skills, Alright guys, so in order to jump rope like Iron Mike Tyson, you need to be able to master four basic but yet complicated skills. The basic bounce, the side swipe, the squat jump, and the crossover. Let's go over those real quick. So your basic bounce is just two feet over the rope, nice and smooth, nice and consistent. What you might find is that the feet sort of change weight from side to side, but we're basically doing a nice simple jump over the rope. It's our basic bounce or our boxer step. Next one, we're going to make sure that we can jump in and out of the loop, which is our side swipe. Again guys, all of these will be referenced here in the link if you want to click on it to master those skills before coming back to this video. So the side swipe is going from the open to the side. Open to the side. Making sure you can jump in and out of the loop. This will open you up to many more skills and vary your training to make it more versatile for all the jump rope things you want to do in the future or other exercises or other sports you want to get better at. Next one is the squat. When we do the jump squat, very important that we differentiate between a regular squat and a jump squat. So I'm going to put the rope down for right now. Let's just go over the squat real quick. A regular squat, we make sure the heels are on the ground, ass to grass, all the way back up, down and back up. When we're doing a jump squat, we want to make sure we have that nice rebound ability. So we're actually going to keep the heels up, we're going to stay on the toes, get down nice and low, and then back up. So if you want, practice a few of these, getting staying with the toes down, heels up, squatting down low, and coming back up. What this does is it makes sure it drops your hips right down onto your heels and doesn't throw you off balance, right? Knees out, down, and back up down and back up. The more precise this is, the easier it's going to be for you to be jumping through your squats and opening up just like Iron Mike Tyson. Let's try it with a jump. So we're going to take advantage of that side swipe that we know how to do. Bounce step, side swipe. As you're side swiping, go down for your squat. From the side it looks like this. As I'm pulling the rope to the side, I'm keeping the heels up, I'm going straight down, hips to heels. I'm not leaning forward, I'm not leaning backwards, I'm making sure that all the weight goes down onto the balls of my feet as I squat down. So how do we work this, Levi? Let me answer that question. Let's go four bounce steps to four side swipes, adding a squat. Ready? Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Jump back in. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and jump through it. It's very important for you to actually count those jumps so you get the cadence right. We often try and actually speed up when we're going through these drills, which is gonna zap you of energy and it's gonna zap your technicality. So make sure you get those bounces in every time. All right, team, so we're gonna do a real quick jump like Mike Tyson circuit. Four bounces, four side swipes, one squat. Repeat. Ready, here we go. Bounce step, 
Side swipe, one squat. Bounce step, side swipe, one squat. Bounce step, side swipe, one squat. Side swipe, one squat. So that way we're building up the skills to emulate our man, Iron Mike Tyson. Let's make it a little bit more intense. Say you have all those skills down. Now you wanna repeat your jump squat. Let's do it in sets of four, shall we? So we're gonna go bounce, side, one, two, three, four. Back to bounce, recover, go for another four. One, two, three, four. Recover, go for another four. One, two, three, four. Recover, one more time. Bounce side, one, two, three, and four. Excellent. Whew. Right on, guys. That also gets you pretty cooked right away. So make sure you give yourself a time to relax, rest, get your breath back, and let's try another combo. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the crossovers into the side swipe and squat game. So we're gonna go four bounces, four crossovers, and four squats, and we're gonna repeat that just like Iron Mike Tyson does. So again, with the rope, so you're gonna go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, squat, one, two, three, four. Back to the bounce step, cross it. One, two, three, four, squat, one, two, three, four. Bounce it, recover, cross it. One, two, three, four, squat, one, two, three. One more time, guys. Cross it. One, two, Three, four, squat, two, three, and four. Woo! Yep. <laughs> so team, as you can see, these combos are made up of simple elements put together with fluidity and virtuosity, which is why we love to emulate our favorite boxers, Floyd Mayweather, Mike Tyson, Sugar Ray Leonard, and any other guy that we see training because they are so smooth and so slick. With practice and determination, you can definitely achieve the same level of confidence and proficiency with your jump rope. Till next time guys, I'm your man Jumper Rope, Levi James. Keep jumping on the daily and we'll bring you tons of amazing content if you like, subscribe, and comment on the video. Till then team.